HubSpot versus Monday.com. Hi guys, welcome back. Today I am going to be comparing Monday.com with HubSpot.com. We'll compare their different features, how these platforms actually work and their pricing plans as well. So at first what you have to do is you will simply go to HubSpot.com and I will show you HubSpot first and then we'll check out Monday.com. So before we get into the features of Monday.com and HubSpot, let's compare the pricing plans. So you have the idea about the affordability of these platforms. So let's check out the pricing plan for HubSpot.com. So you can see right here, HubSpot is all in one platform, right? It has marketing, it has sales, it has customer service, CRM, CMS, and operations as well. So they have kind of like, you know, created different pricing plans for each of these different options. So this is actually pretty good. And you can see right here that this is the CRM suit as well. And it is $45 per month. So we are looking at the CRM and automation operations so this is the reason we are comparing monday.com and hubspot today because these both platforms are very similar because they are all in one platforms and you get a lot of features in both of these platforms so that is why uh, i wanted to show you that which one is better for you to use for your crm and what are the basic features we get so if we talk about the pricing plan of the crm plan of hubspot then you will get a crm series in $45 per month, $540 if you are billed um, yearly. So $45 per month. Um, that is not that cheap, I would say. But if we talk about the features, we will check out the features, right? So I think it's reasonable. So you can see right here, even in the marketing, how we are getting the starter for 45, professional for 800, and then enterprise is really, really expensive, which is like $3,000. If we talk about the operations, then you will get $45. So the starter is $45. We can say that on HubSpot, each plan is starting from $45, but we also have the free tools. So this is pretty amazing that on HubSpot, we are getting a free tool as well, which is like a free plan. In free plan, we get content management, we get content website activity, companies, deals, tasks, and activities, and other features as well. So we have a free plan on HubSpot, and then the CRM or operations start from $45 and go up to thousands of dollars that is the pricing plan for hubspot now let's check out the pricing plan for monday.com so on monday the pricing plan is very simple uh, it is not divided according to different tools uh, so this is like these basic plans and you will get different you know features in these plans so if we check the pricing plan for monday.com we are getting a free plan which is zero dollars and it is free forever then we have a basic plan which is eight dollars then we have a a standard plan which is ten dollars then we have a pro plan which is sixteen dollars per member per month so you can see right here we're getting a free plan then the basic starts from just eight dollars and then we have a pro plan which is 16 and then an enterprise is also available with a lot of different other features but if we talk about these plans like these very cheap ones like eight dollars and zero dollars they do not have that much of features the automation and crm start from uh, ten dollars so that is how monday.com works but if we talk about the pricing then monday.com is actually much cheaper than hubspot.com now let's check out the features for hubspot.com uh, what you have to do is you will simply go to hubspot.com and you will land on this platform right here hubspot is an amazing all-in-one platform with a lot of different features uh different dashboards that you are going to get you get a marketing hub sales hub service hub cms and operation hub as well getting started with hubspot is really really easy you simply click on start free or get a demo and you can actually, you know, get started for free. I have also, you know, created my free account. The sign up process is really easy. You simply sign up with your email address or you can simply sign in with your Google account. So I have signed into my HubSpot. This is the dashboard that you get on HubSpot. So you can see right here, we have all dashboards. We have CMS, 
marketing sales and services so now i can actually you know get access to any of these we have automation we have contact in contact we have company calls activity feed and list then in the conversations we have inbox chat flows snippets and templates in marketing we have ads email landing page social company forms in sales we have deal task document meetings payments playbooks and codes in services we have ticket services hub in automation we have sequence and workflow in reports we have different dashboards and analytics tools so now i can go to any of these different you know dashboards and get access to any of these different you know features using uh you know hubspot is really easy it's not that complicated at all you simply you know go to any of the dashboard and in dashboards we have different uh you know tools we can create contacts we can go ahead and create uh if it's a, a crm right so we can create different uh you know contact then we can go for views you can get board views you can get list views uh if you want to switch between the dashboards you can just go ahead and do that at any time uh we have our profile right here we have notifications settings given if you want to create anything let's just create a contact and let me actually show you how we work on hubspot so on hubspot we get a lot of features and an insight to creating our own contact or anything so to create a contact you simply add an email address let's just simply add any email address then you have to add the first name and the last name of your contact so let's just say i want to add a contact name alex and the last name is going to be smith so that's what I am going to do. Simply then I have to add a job title, phone number, and then, you know, life cycle stage and lead status as well. Once you have added all of these information, simply click on create contact and your new contact will be created with HubSpot. If I want to create an email marketing campaign, you will simply go to the emails right here and you will be able to do that as well. So we do not get email marketing on monday.com, but we get email marketing on hubspot and when it comes to creating different tasks i would say that hubspot is actually a little more professional than monday.com and it has uh, you know like all in one it's like a more of a email marketing uh you know campaign creator and with sales and automation that's like basic uh you know category we kind of like divide a hubspot into but monday.com is a you know project management software with crm and automation as well so this is the view of hubspot.com let's check out monday.com now so I have signed into my monday.com signing up process for Monday is really easy all you have to do is you simply sign up with your email address or you can sign up with your Google account as well this is monday.com so we have notification we have inbox and my work as well we have integrations in white people apps and then this is the workspaces i can switch between different workspaces you can have more than one workspace and each workspace has different options and has different uh you know boards and we create different lists so let's just say this is one of my boards let's change the name of this board and let's call it test one okay whatever name you want to give so you will simply add the name if you want to add an item you simply click right here let's call it item four click enter then we can add you know person like to what person you want to assign your task to then we have different statuses i can simply add you know done right here and it will be done um, then you can also add different lists you can uh, search by person you can filter them we have the power-ups and now an important thing that i want to show you so on monday.com we get the integration of hubspot as well so you can actually add any of your hubspot dashboard let's just say your marketing sales operation automation any hubspot dashboard can be added to your monday.com so we can actually work with both of these platforms that is how it works and this is actually really really amazing i have personally added my marketing to my monday.com so it's really easy to do you simply you know add your hubspot to your monday.com and you are good to go so that is how uh it works and then uh we get the automation option in automate we will get the automation center board automation account usage and much more so you can use monday.com for different uh you know purposes for automation and 
you can add different you know features you can add workspaces and you can create different boards as well to create a new board you will simply click right here and then you know add a new board if you want to do any changes into the board you can do that as well if you want to add the date to your project simply add right here add different tasks and start managing your team right now so yeah guys this brings us to the end of the video don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the youtube channel